But anyways, all right, Jackson from Malone here. Talk me through the race, start to finish. It um went okay. Conditions were nice. I tried to stay steady throughout the whole thing. Um, guy from Jay, he was he was ahead of me pretty much the whole time. Went. I was gonna try and catch him at the end, but just I don't know, couldn't couldn't really muster it. But it was uh no, all it was it was a pretty good day to run. I should have should have capitalized on it. Way more. Okay. So when the guys took off, you know, out of the box like they did, what what was going through your mind? I I was thinking, I was like, they're they're gonna burn out. They're probably gonna burn. It was about four guys. They went and yeah, they ended up burning out well before the first mile. So I would go and um, I tried to stay steady throughout the whole thing. I should have, you know, probably sped up more at the end. But it um, but yeah, just out of the gate, everybody starts out hot. And it, okay. Most of the time, doesn't go good for. Them. Okay, good deal. Now, your racing strategy is very unique. You take it out like Prefontaine and then just try to hold on. Talk me through that racing strategy. Have you always been that way? I have, a, like, a mental thing where, like, the lowest speed I go, I can't go back higher. So I try to start out high and just gradually go down instead of, like, going slow and then speeding up. Like, you see some kids run the last half mile full speed, but the rest of the race wasn't all that fast. So, but yes, that's my way. I just I'd kind of start and then try to gradually make my way down. Okay, now today I believe is your fastest time of the season, correct? Um, it is, it's just about, my fastest was 18. This is like 18.06 or something, but it was, it, yes sir, it was one of my fastest. Okay, seasons. so halfway through the season, how you feeling going into postseason? I'm feeling okay. Uh, it should continue to get colder, better, some more nice courses. This is a, this is a really nice course to run. It's pretty consistent, but um, but yeah, I, I, think, I think I'll be 1730s if not, Aiming for six, I'm aiming for 16 this year. I hit low 17s last year. Okay. So going into district meet, how are you thinking about placing? Are you sizing up your com uh, competitors so far? Last year, I think it was Pensacola Christian had two guys beat me, and I came in third. One of the guys graduated, so I'm looking for around definitely top five. So okay. yeah. Good deal. How about you looking at another state appearance? I'm Yes, sir. Fully fully aim towards that. Should, yeah, going to. We try to make it. It was great last year. It's a nice environment to have. So yeah, we try. We can try to make it. Okay. Now, only last question. Only a sophomore. How does that feel going into it? And how do you how do you feel kind of the next couple of years to come? It feels pretty good. Um, now I'm two sport. I do basketball and cross country. So it's kind of like a transition, like different shapes to be. And so over the summer, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to run a lot more next summer. Trying, you know, as as a junior, get some 16s and, and below. But yeah, I feel I feel pretty good about it.